Hey everybody, welcome back to D-Zoned. Let's go ahead and fire up the Wadnator and see what she's got in store for us today. E1M1F. Uh, we played one of these before. Uh, let's see. I think it was, oh yeah, it was H. Because I remember uh, Joe Ilya's comment. The H stands for, huh? Which was fantastic. So, um, thank you for that. <laughs> Now, uh, let's go ahead and see what this is. I wonder if it's just going to be another edit of E1M1. Let's find out. It is. Uh, we're starting in a very different spot. Okay. Um, the heck? So, um, this is a, definitely a, definitely a vibe. Oh, hey, at least they remembered to start the, uh, turn the hurt floor thing off. Okay, um... I mean... There's definitely some texture mods. It's kind of making, I don't know, E1M1 look maybe a little more E1M2-ish. Oh, that's, that's just cute. <laughs> I like that. So that's, huh. Okay, that takes a red key, and that's actually hurt floor. Okay, um... I don't know about this one. Oh, okay, so they just moved the nuke edge. Got it. Okay, so that's where the red key is. Also, some more of that little cute sky texture action. I don't know, I'll just balls to the wall. Let's go ahead and grab all this shit. Why not, right? Uh, mm, 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 mm. So this is actually like an, a path that you take. I think that Kako's still alive. Sorry, Kako's. Sorry, I didn't, didn't mean to forget about your brother. Okay, now let's just go ahead and uh, do that. Cool. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, you know, one thing I will say. Uh, oh, okay. Nifty. One thing I will say, at least there's not a cyber demon down there. There you are. <laughs> I mean, I, hmm. I guess I, I don't really understand the whole thing with people just modifying id levels and then releasing them as this. I don't know. It seems a little weird to me. I mean, I've done stuff like this for, like, my personal projects, but just go fuck yourself. So it just kind of seems a little bit strange to uh, just release it. Also, just going to throw this out there. Anyone who does shit like that gets an automatic one. There's good traps, there's good crusher traps even. That's not one of them. That's the exit. One out of ten. Alright, let's try a different one. Death 2. Alright, let's actually do the, the, the Omelette Doom 2 fromage. Let's go ahead and try this out. And we're already off to a fantastic start. Not so much with those chain gunners, but definitely with this bad boy. What? Oh, okay. For a second, I thought that was Hurt Floor, but then the damage numbers didn't add up. Okay, well, now I'm sad because I ran out of ammo because I royally overused that. Oh, well. As I often say, not mentioning names, but somebody decided to waste all the super shotgun ammo. Okay, give me a chain gun. Give me your... It kind of feels like this was intended to be a deathmatch map and they just kind of threw monsters in just to make it work in single player. Definitely, definitely kind of getting that vibe from it. I will say the wide open areas combined with the uh, actual odd lack of ammo in general. Hmm. Not the most pleasant experience, but, you know, 
Anyway, the reason I say that is mostly because of these teleporters. Which, oh, okay. So, I mean, that is definitely a way of uh, allowing players to move around quite freely. Okay. Yeah, the lack of ammo is uh, definitely making me a little sad. I should really be mindful of where the uh, exit switch is. What the f... Uh, okay. Alright. Sure. I'll just go over here and... Really? An arch file? Buddy! You didn't give the player any ammo or health! What the fuck are you doing? Alright, let's play it the way the author clearly intended it to be played, because... What the fuck? Go all the way, right? The thing is, I'm not even necessarily sure if this is intended to be a deathmatch map, because it's like... I don't know. Uh, you have these... Like, it's definitely opening up in some sort of fashion. But, I mean, there's no ammo. There's no health. And there were like four arch vials. <laughs> what? Unless there's an inv- But no, no, it doesn't matter if there was an invuln. That wouldn't make up for the lack of health. I mean, this has gotta be- This has gotta be intended to be a deathmatch map, right? Right? I'm gonna stand by that. But... I don't know. I would say this is one of those- cases where if you do just want to make a deathmatch level, don't feel compelled to add enemies. I mean, yeah, I guess it raised the pillars up to deal with the arch files, but that doesn't matter if you don't have any fucking ammo. Unless there's just some hidden cache that you're expected to find. I mean, I guess it's possible. Nope, you don't just poke that. It definitely seems to be how you get the plasma rifle. This is just so cryptic. And I don't know where the exit is. <laughs> it's probably in one of these, like... These things. So how would you actually... What? I don't get it. I think you just walked through that, actually. Yeah. Because, you know, that's... Oh my god. So, yeah, basically, all the little paths here are pretty much completely... I mean, you can't just... Mm, I don't know. Basically just... No, it seems to only be that one that goes down automatically. What is this? I, I don't know what this is, and this is like one of those cases where I just really, really wish they would have included a text file. Oh, you just walked through that. Okay. But where they would have included the text file. That way I could know what the hell I was playing. Because, man, I have no idea what the hell this is. Aside from just knowing that it plays terribly. <laughs> Okay, that brings you back to the beginning. I, there were other ways I could have done that, but whatever. I'm not also not seeing an exit switch, so... Yeah. Another thing to kind of lend credence to this being a deathmatch level, but... Hmm. And, okay. Nice little shooty hole, I guess. And again, that invuln would not have helped because there's not enough ammo to deal with the threats unless they just expect you to punch arch files to death without berserk. You already know what I'm going to give this map. So I'm just going to go ahead and cap off the ep <laughs> this episode here. Wow. Uh, yeah. Good stuff. Shrug. 
Anyway, that's all for now. Thank you very much for watching. I'm going to just go ahead and just soak my head in bleach. I don't fucking know. This was... This is a bad episode. And you know what? Sometimes you have those. And I'm not going to give it a chance to redeem itself. We're just going to cap it right here. And uh, that'll be that. So anyway, thank you very much for watching. Hope you have a happy Thursday. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. Take it easy.